Hey, what's up? Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Bob and Goddess. Welcome to my channel, y'all. So if you guys are new for the first time, welcome. If you have been rocking with me, though, you already know what it is. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. So what's up, Capricorn? <laughs> All right, guys, what's going on, Capricorn? This is your monthly reading, okay? This is not a love reading, guys. This is guidance and also forecast for the month of September. All right, um, take what resonates, guys. Don't force it if it's not your story. These readings are general. Okay, guys, so woman holding a coin, guys. Um, and I kind of got the image while I was meditating on you guys. Like somebody's working, 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 working really hard, just punching that clock, right? And, you know, there may be, there may, you could be doing it for somebody, right, possibly, because the song is, I, I don't want anybody but you, babe, right? There's something either that you want or somebody that you want, and you're just really kind of going at it really hard, potentially, guys. Um, <clears throat> there's a need to kind of, you know, take a stop, take a step back, like break, right? Rejuvenate yourself, guys. Water, you know, do things like that to kind of refill yourself. All right, guys? All right. So let's see, though. Let's see what else is going on. Somebody need to hear that, y'all. <laughs> What's going on for Capricorn for the month of September, Spirit? Let it be real. Let it be great. Let it be real. I was drawn to the word energy, guys, okay? Um, contracts, all right? So contracts in reverse. Is that the one? Um, contracts in reverse, guys. Okay, so ultimately that's like something maybe kind of being delayed. Something um, not working out possibly. Maybe somebody's going through a divorce, guys. Just something being delayed. Yeah, something's being delayed, guys, here, okay? Um, so be patient, though, right? You got the patience card here. Divine time. And is that work here? All right, you can trust the process. All right, guys. Maybe I need to kind of look over things carefully. Um, and then you have man holding a heart, guys. So for me, this could be, and um, this is the number nine, guys. So for me, this is like kind of, you know, that Hermit energy retreating so you can refill your batteries okay being this could be somebody coming into your life to kind of help you this could be you really kind of passionate about somebody or something here okay door to value guys there's some kind of delay in something all right an opportunity maybe being missed opportunity being closed potentially guys all right door to value let's see all right y'all see what's going on with you guys capricorn Something about timing. Door to value. About a home. Contract. Homes. Possibly, guys. All right. Contracts. Papers. Documents being signed. Something like that is being. Something about your family, right? Your emotional fulfillment, right? The man of the man holding a heart. So it's like either you're wanting to do this for your family or you're wanting your emotional fulfillment here, okay? Um, somebody's kind of working really hard for somebody, for something here, okay? Maybe to relocate, um, possibly. We'll see, though. Ten of Cups, your emotional fulfillment, though. All right, guys, you guys want the storm to be over. You want to move to better days here, okay? If things were at a standstill, you're ready for things to keep on moving going forward. I want you to move on. I want things to move on here, okay? So what's the focus for the month, guys? Yeah, you guys are waiting for something. Either you're waiting to sign a contract, maybe it has something to do with money, maybe it has something to do with the home. Maybe you're waiting on a whole person, an individual, but you're waiting on love, potentially, guys. Um, but this is you guys, once again, this is a hardworking individual, right? So you guys are working really hard for something, and you're waiting for your harvest. You're waiting for your abundance. You're waiting for um, just something to kind of come in that's going to bring you a lot of emotional fulfillment here. All right, you guys have done the research or you're doing the research here. Um, you're analyzing, you're, you're planning, you're prioritizing to figure out how can you bring this harvest in. You guys, or some of you guys are just working really hard here, okay? And there is a need to make sure that you're kind of bringing balance, patience, love, right, to your life here, okay? So that way you can kind of, you know, be able to go back out there and bring in the value here, okay? Um, it could be money, but value is just whatever it is that you value. Maybe it's health. Maybe it's food. Maybe it's relationships, guys. Or maybe it's money, okay? But it's whatever it is that you value, okay? There could be some kind of delay or some kind of closure. Maybe something kind of stopped, right? So what are three cards surrounding this? Okay, yeah, Empress, all right? 
So for some of you guys, yeah, this is about a relationship. I don't want it to be about relationships, guys. But some of you guys, this is about a relationship, right? A mother figure, maybe your mother here, um, an empress, a goddess, um, somebody who is motherly. But she is very abundant here. You guys are wanting this new abundant opportunity, this new beginning here. All right, everything that she touches turns to gold, especially because she's putting in the work. She has the heart to back it up, right? And it's bringing her emotional fulfillment. There's no stopping her. So you guys are waiting for this new beginning. You could be waiting for a person. In, all right uh, maybe waiting for a business potentially but you guys once again mothers something about mothers uh, children family potentially uh, maybe it's your own business you guys are waiting to sign those contracts here um, you're just ready you're ready for you in the beginning you're, you're waiting to kind of be confident again you're waiting for a chapter to close you're waiting for one door to close where maybe somebody was not feeling valued somebody was not feeling appreciated and you're just ready to go ahead and start this new journey right be independent be sexy again all right fall in love again here okay be restored emotional fulfillment right you're ready for your happiness the sunflower is a sun card guys so this is you're waiting for that happiness that happy news here okay maybe it's a leo person a leo woman or just a fire sign somebody who's very sexy okay maybe you're working really hard to bring somebody a new beginning potentially guys right all right y'all some of y'all guys some of you guys though are maybe kind of getting a divorce and you guys are just being independent all right healing from something all right guys so uh, the four of swords is all about healing it's all about a break all right that's what i'm saying that go 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 energy guys so this is you know just kind of taking a step back there could be a delay right that's making some that's causing some kind of frustration some kind of anger some kind of pain some kind of disappointment here um this is you know just be patient take a step back right just relax chill get some rest and um clarity is going to come to you in a different form here okay you'll be offered some kind of insight all right some of you guys are healing though because of some kind of ending that ended in your life guys right the four of swords healing okay guys Yeah, guys. Um, all right, y'all. So let's see. What's in your recent past, Capricorn? <laughs> Sorry, y'all. Okay, Capricorn, what's in your recent past? Pisces energy. Maybe it's a whole Pisces person. Like I said, some of you guys could be kind of either separating from somebody or you're doing this for somebody here, okay? You're trying to bring in some kind of value, some kind of abundance, some kind of new lifestyle for somebody. Um, the hangman, though, this is definitely, you know, you're just trying to be chill. You're trying to be, like, go with the flow. You're trying to see the bigger picture. You're trying to surrender, right? You're trying to find acceptance in the situation. You're just trying to not force it, all right? You're just trying to wait. You're trying to be patient here, okay? That's what you're, yeah, you're, you guys are trying to be patient. You want your happiness, but you're not just overly analyzing and kind of getting in your head a little bit about it, right? You found acceptance in the situation. You've learned a lot. You've leveled up here. All right, and you've learned to just kind of chill, okay? What do you guys want? You want that good news, though? Hey, I want that communication. I want that message. I want that offer here. I want that new beginning. So some of you guys are waiting for some kind of communication from a man or a woman, right, that's going to offer you a new beginning here, okay, in love, potentially. Otherwise, you guys are just waiting for something that's going to bring you a lot of emotional fulfillment and that's going to be able to bring you a new beginning here, okay? You guys are waiting to kind of level up, right? Possibly, guys, the Empress and Page of Wands. You know, the Empress is a goddess. Page of Wands is all, you know, that to me is like spirituality. So you're kind of waiting to kind of get leveled up spiritually, possibly, guys, here. All right, closing out old cycles and, you know, really just going with the flow, going into the new. All right. Now, for some of you guys, this could be you waiting on somebody younger or older, potentially, guys, the Empress and the Page of Wands. That's, that's like an age difference here, okay? But, yeah, you guys are maybe ready to start a new journey, guys. He's a traveler, okay? So this is all about starting a new beginning, um, being confident, having faith, and just being optimistic here, right? I'm ready for this new message of good news that's going to bring me everything that I desire and everything that I hope for. All right, so what are your fears, guys, okay? Uh, patience. <laughs> So you guys are waiting long enough, right? And it's just like, you know, I'm waiting for this contract to be signed. I'm waiting for this money. I'm waiting for this abundance, okay? I'm waiting for this marriage. I'm waiting for this divorce, guys, right? I'm just waiting for this message of good news. I'm waiting for this new beginning here. I'm tired of fighting. I'm tired of just being so strong here, okay? I'm feeling a little bit burnt out, you know? I'm just kind of, I've been go, 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 all right? And I'm trying to plan, but 
I feel like I planned enough here. I'm ready for my emotional fulfillment. Bring me that good news here. Okay, some of you guys are maybe feeling a little bit tired, right? You can, some of you guys don't want to stop, right? Some of you guys are not wanting to stop. It's like, I want to continue to put in the fight for this because I've already planted the seeds. I've already been putting in the work for this. There's no way I'm going to just sit here and let this opportunity pass me by. I'm not going to let this door close here. So some of you guys are a little bit afraid to kind of stop and take a break and rest here because it's like, I'm looking at this new beginning. I can see it here. It, it means the world to me. It means a lot to me. I'm not going to stop. I'm going to try to get it done by any means necessary for my family, for myself, because it brings me, it brings me emotional fulfillment, guys, okay? Um, some of you guys, though, like I said, just uh, don't be scared or don't be afraid to kind of lean on others for help here, okay? Because this person can be a little bit guarded, can be a little bit bruised. And then the Queen of Wands is somebody who is so independent that she sometimes won't reach out for anybody here. So don't be afraid to kind of reach out, right? If you're needing help, support, healing, okay, guys, just don't be scared and don't be afraid here. All right, guys, so what's the advice from Spirit? Ooh. All right, guys. So peace of mind here. All right. This is the good news. This is the celebration, right? Some of you guys, this is a baby. All right. But this is, you know, let love be what drives you here. Fill up your own cup, guys, right? I, I kind of got that because right before I did your reading, guys, I finished my water bottle and I threw it in the garbage. And here it is here, okay? So it's refill your cup here, okay? Find that balance. Find that restoration. Find the peace here. Fill up your own cup so that you can go ahead and allow... Some of you guys, my, my iPad just glitched, right? So spirit, universe, um, evolving, spirit. Okay, rest, right? Some of you guys rest and meditate so that spirit can talk to you, so that your universe, so that your higher self, so that they can talk to you to kind of help give you guidance and help move you along potentially, guys, all right? Others of you guys, this is you kind of filling up your own cup, healing, self-love, all right, guys? This could be somebody kind of reuniting with somebody after there was a break, no contact, communication. Maybe somebody was sleeping on you or you were sleeping on somebody, but it's something that you guys were waiting for and then is the universe universe or spirit is saying hey continue to focus on love here and maybe a little bit delayed be patient maybe if there was one opportunity or one door that closed there's another door that's going to open here we want you to still have the faith we want you to still be optimistic here okay drunk in love guys with this big old cups looks like drunk in love to me here okay so be drunk in love not worry not fear not anxiety don't be anxious here okay just trust and know that it's coming <laughs> some of you guys maybe you guys gotta kind of you know have some fun all right in the bedroom as advice okay because this man is laying here and we got the ace of cups and then we got the ten of cups right some of you guys just go have some fun potentially here uh, but the Ace of Cups is be around family, be around things that make you happy, be around things that kind of give you a high vibration. And for sure, if there's something that you are very passionate about, if there's somebody or something that you love, go ahead and extend that offer, guys, okay, with the Ace of Cups. All right, y'all. You do have forward movement here, okay. Um, you have obstacles, some kind of communication, downloads, right, if you're, like, spiritual. Um, but this is definitely obstacles are being removed and communication or forward movement is coming in here. But I feel like, you know, there's just a little bit of a delay here. Okay, guys? All right, so what else, Spirit? Contract, maybe some contracts don't go through, guys, potentially. Something doesn't work out potentially, but you're being asked to be patient, all right, and still, um, and still go ahead and continue to put in the work for what you want, okay? Because taking move or <laughs> I don't know why I can't talk, y'all. It's time to move here, okay? Taking action, no longer being stuck, right? Whatever it is that you're waiting for, guys, by the end of the month here, right? Whatever it is you're waiting for, that 10, and I moved this 10 of cups right over to this ace of cups here. So it's like you get that good news here. You get that celebration. You get that peace offering for you and your family. Your wishes do um, come true here, right? There's some waiting. There's some healing. There's a break. There's a distance between what you're waiting for and it actually coming into fruition. But I feel like it's coming here. 
okay? Relocating. Make a decision, guys. Break through mental clarity, all right? Um, what do you have to lose? And new journeys lie ahead for some of you guys, right? What is your spirit calling you to do, y'all? So let's see. What else? Some of you guys are, yeah, some of you guys are really in love with something or somebody here, okay? Expect the unexpected, y'all. Miracles help a surprise. All right, good news, bad news, or messages incoming or outgoing. Some changes are going to take place, guys. We see it here. There's going to be some kind of movement going, going on here. Um, incoming or outgoing money. All right, some of you guys may have some money going out. All right, if you're moving potentially or if just something is changing, you may be investing in that possibly, okay? Some of you guys may have a contract that you were hoping for. Maybe it might not work out or maybe there might be some adjustments that maybe kind of take place with that where it kind of flips around, right? Um, Ace of Cups, though. So your happiness is here on the board, okay? You're right where you're supposed to be. All right, new partnerships, friendships, and relationships, all right? Something new is on the way for you guys. All right, what else? What else for Capricorn Spirit? All right, so this card wants to keep coming out. So you're right where you're supposed to be, guys. So go with the flow. Be patient. Breathe, y'all. It's okay. All right, you're being divinely guided. Of course, you are with the angel. Divine timing is at work, so you know you're being divinely guided. All right, divine timing is the best timing. You will have success and victory. Trust and have faith. Keep going. And a time to rest. For some of you guys, it's a time to heal here, okay? And be in the moment. That's what this hangman represents. Don't forget to continue to do that and be that here, okay? And then we have this. That's a strong message. Message, guys be in the moment all right face your current reality and be present surrender and trust to the process all right focus on what's being presented in front of you um, so that it can be cleared all right guys vision for the future but live in the now and release control to the outcome and and just kind of go with the flow guys all right <laughs> Patience, all right? What you wanted is coming, all right? Continue to visualize and be optimistic, guys. That's what the Ace of Cups is here. I don't want no I don't want nobody else but you. Right? I don't want no one I don't want nobody else but you. Trey Songs, right? I don't know. I, I said it but I kinda messed it up, y'all. All right, but whatever it is that you want, right? You don't want nothing else but that, it's coming here. For some of you guys, a year from now, all right? Um, just continue to visualize the dream. Be patient and slow down. Put to continue to put in the work, right? There may be some changes that kind of take place with how you get whatever it is that you're wanting, okay? You may need to take a reroute here. All right, y'all? Within a year from now, maybe by the end of this year, okay? Um... And what changes are needed to go ahead and bring in whatever you're wanting. All right, guys. So, anything else there for Capricorn? Forty-five nine. Um, that's hermit hermit card energy. Yeah, you guys balance out that passion and love here. Okay, kind of retreating from the rest of the world, going within, spending that time alone so that you can regroup. I don't want nobody else but you. That's what it says. All right, guys, whatever that nobody else but you is, all right, it's coming in. You guys are working really hard for it. All right, just continue to be in um, Empress mode, too, which is all about receiving, right? She's not chasing anything, right? The Empress, whatever she wants comes to her, so you have to put in the work for it, of course, but this is not being thirsty, right? This is just kind of knowing that I planted enough good seeds out there to get my harvest. I know it's coming in. For, I know it's coming in, and I'm not going to be stressing about it here. I'm just chilling. I'm going to let it come in here for me here. I'm being a queen. I'm wearing my crown all right i don't really have to take action because i already put in the work and i'm just chilling resting meditating healing okay some of you guys could be healing from something that didn't work out potentially but it's it's some it's because something else is opening up for you here okay yeah the storm is clear the storm is clearing guys okay y'all all right y'all um yeah all right, y'all, that's it. That's all I have for you guys. I love you guys, okay? So please like, share, subscribe. All right, if you want to book a personal reading, hop over to my website. And as always, y'all talk to your girl. I'll talk back, y'all. Peace.